Let's talk sports. It's Bama Day. The school taking center stage at SEC Media Days in Dallas. We head out to the Lone Star State to find 48 Sports anchor Cam Durr. Cam, you got to ask some non-football questions to the Crimson Tide. How about it? Yeah, hey, how about it, right? Well, we're, Margo, we're still about six Saturdays off from kickoff for college football, but in less than 10 days, the 2024 Paris Olympics will get underway. And so, you know, I had to ask when we spoke with Jalen Milrow, Malachi Moore, and Tyler Booker earlier this morning, if they were traveling to Paris for the Olympics, which team they would be traveling with? I would do track and I would throw. So actually, up until the eighth grade, I threw shot put, discus, and javelin. And I was pretty good in shot put and discus, but in javelin, I won regionals for um, the Northeast. So I think if, if I wasn't playing football, I'd be out there heading to Paris soon. <laughs> hey, I'm gonna I'm I'm say, say basketball, just cause that's, I feel like that's the closest thing I, I can be an Olympian to, if that, if that makes sense. I'll be running track. What event? 100. What What is your 100, you know? If I, am I stretching? You got to. All that stuff? I can push now. I, I'll be in the nines. I'll be in the nines. Late nines. Hey, well, Jalen Melrose, he said he could move now. And I believe it. He can move a heck of a lot faster than I can, so he's got a better... Uh, opportunity possibly to go, go to Paris for that. But all, all jokes aside, we are going to hear more from those guys coming up at 5 and throughout the weekend. And you can also catch the Olympics on our channel, WFF 48, starting on July 26. So join me back at 5 o'clock. We'll, we jump right back into the media days and we hear more from the Alabama Crimson Tide. For now, reporting live in Dallas, Camder, 48 Sports on your